my name is Rick Sanchez. I'm with a company called Tractor Tip Equipment, and what we have for sale here today is a couple of dumps, dumpers. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about the mechanics of these particular machines in the first clip, the operating specs in the second, we'll run them in the third. Um, if you buy these machines from me or some of the others I have for sale, you're going to be dealing with Per Provencio. He's my right hand man, he's the guy running the camera. Uh, price on a new machine like this these days is. Uh, I don't know, 55 grand. These are uh, brand new machines and they've got two year warranties on them. So, um, Like I say, they're brand new. I mean, I don't know what else to say about that other than uh, they're good running machines. Mechalac is a, uh, they're an up and coming uh, uh, equipment manufacturer. We've actually considered, uh, talk to them about taking on a dealership for them uh, here in the Dallas Fort Worth area. Don't know if we're gonna do that. So, um, the hours on these machines are zero. I mean, we might use them a little bit here and there and move them around, so they might accumulate a few hours here and there, but for all intents and purposes, they're brand new. The weight of these machines is 5,456 pounds. The widest point are the tires at six foot five inches. The tallest point is the top of that, uh, there's a little beacon light right here and it's nine foot six inches. This right here is probably, I'm 6'1", so this is probably, I don't know, five foot nine uh, is the tallest part. The transportation length is 12 foot. Oh, because this, this actually folds down, I guess what I'm trying to say. It folds the opposite way. So this is probably like five foot nine. Um, the length is 12 foot 11 inches. Um, as far as options go, uh, like I say, they got it's got a brand new warranty. These are four wheel drive machines. Uh, we'll probably hook hook a chain up to them or something, and just have the put them in uh, drive them forward just to see that all four, four tires spin. Just to show you guys, uh, these have got Kubota engines. They're 25 horsepower Kubotas. Those are bulletproof engines. That engine will last forever. You can't kill those engines. They're in everything from Caterpillar, John Deere, Komatsu, Case, Cabelco. All the, all the small utility equipment have those uh, engines in them. And that's probably why Mackalak uh, chose to, uh, chose to uh, use them. This machine, these machines are completely hydrostatic Top speed is about 12 miles an hour. Uh, these tires are 11.580, uh, 15.3s are 100%. As you can see, they still have the uh, the little uh, titties on them or whatever you call them. Um, the hydraulics are strong on these machines. Uh, brake stop them on a dime because they're hydrostatic. You really don't even need a brake They just come to a stop when you uh, let off the pedal uh, The payload capacity of these uh, buckets here Are 6,600 pounds they'll, they'll haul up to 6,600 pounds in a go and uh, This is equivalent to about two and a half yards of material so that's about it with these machines. Uh, we're gonna run them in the next clip. Oh, the other option is there is a battery disconnect switch here. So you can uh, actually pull that, it's a keyed switch. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and run them in the next clip. And um, Perf, what'd you think about these? Well, I noticed they're very advanced machinery and they're still yet very straightforward, easy to use. Yeah, we've had Marukas in the past and these just seem like uh, like such a much better option. 
So uh, yeah, there's no special bells or whistles. Very straightforward. Yeah, there it's machine. it's pretty much a mechanical machine, and there's no there's no depth, there's no crazy electronics. I mean, it's just a it's just an engine powering a pump, powering the uh, your work equipment. I mean, it's baling wire and uh, a pair of pliers will fix these things. <laughs> Um, so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna run them in the next clip and uh, good luck. Well, I, oh, by the way, I've had uh, buddies of mine who have bought these, and uh, one of the guys is a concrete guy, and he said that he they weld. Uh, I'm not sure how he affixes it affixes uh, little gate to this, but uh, they they uh, you know will piss out concrete on a on a uh, job site. And he says they have like a little gate on these things and they, so whenever you dump this thing over, uh, it, it acts like a little chute so that they can, so the concrete isn't splashing all over the place. So that's, that's another cool option. Uh, so we're gonna run it in the next clip. So this little video here is just a video to show the tractive effort of the machine and that they are in fact four wheel drive. Go ahead for We don't want to 
nigga, whole few people.